All right, in this quick video, I want to show you how to create this animated GIF that you can put in your description of your of your shirt. Um, and what you want to do is, if you have have different styles of shirts down here, and maybe you have different colors and whatnot, maybe you'd want to sh use um sorry, want to show some of those different colors and different styles with an animated GIF. You can see it's just going through each GIF, excuse me, each GIF there. Sorry, each image, and it's being presented at a as a GIF. GIF is an animated image, so it's just going through each of the images. It's really simple to make one of these. Um, there's a free, lots of free tools online. So the first thing you need to do is you go to your design and you right click and you save image as and you want to save the images that you want to rotate through. So I've already saved them here. So I'd save that one and then I'd want to save, I found a, uh, yeah, the, the tag this T and then there was a long sleeve. When you do the tank, I found the tank top doesn't work very good. It's too long and not wide enough, so it kind of messes up your image. But So I didn't include the tank top in there. But let me show you how to do that. So once you've downloaded them, what I did is I went over to a site called gifmaker.me. And in here, you upload your images. So I'm going to select my, my images. It's going to be my, my hoodie. The T, as well as the long sleeve. Open those three and it'll load up. And then you can see the, the little preview there. And I set the animation speed at 1500 milliseconds or a second and a half, seems to be fine. And then you want to go with the size. I went with 50%. You can go a little bit more if you want. And then you can just go create. And you can actually see the Im if you click this view GIF image, you can see a preview of it. And now let's add it into our description. I've already added it in mine, but I'll show you how to do it here. Log into your account, click on edit details for that shirt. And I'm just going to remove it here and just show you what I did. So at the very beginning, you put your cursor, just hit the return key, and right up here, you click on this image, and you got to enter in the image link here. Now if you have a website, it's recommended to download this GIF to your computer, and then upload it to your website, and then put that link here of where you upload it to your website. If you don't have a website or you don't want to upload it, you can just hot link it if you, will, if you like, but I'm not sure how long they'll leave their GIF images on their site. But given that your campaigns only run seven days at most, it probably would be fine. You can right click this download link, and copy link location. I'm using Firefox in um, let's see what it, what it says in Chrome. I forget what it says. Right click copy link address and so this one's right click copy link location same thing. So once you get that go over to your image tool insert image and then right click and paste that link in there insert. Once you see it in there click save changes and now you've got a nice cool little image where people could come in here and see the different they have different styles so that's pretty cool that's all I really want to show you it's really that simple